Good morning. It is Monday, January 2nd, 2017. Brand new year. Me and my family, we spent the majority of yesterday after we went to service. We ended up driving around and uh, we went to a couple of my listings, did some videos, and then we ended up at my dad's house. And, and on the way there, we started discussing our trips where we were going to go. We have a couple different uh, destinations planned for this year. One for the spring, uh, one in the middle uh, to kind of break up the year, and then one at the holidays that we're going to go into. We went through where we want to stay, what our budget's going to be, what kind of time we want to have there, uh, where we want to stay at, what do we want to see while we're there. We were engaging in the conversation because we wanted to be there now. We wanted to make sure that that was a, a, a an image that was 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 playing out in our minds now, so that we can get up today and go forward and and hit every single one of our goals and accomplishments. We got a lot of time ahead of us. Once again, this clock always keeps repeating itself. It's it's back again, and then if you sleep this year, it'll be back next year to remind you of what either you did or did not do, what you did or did not accomplish, what you did or did not achieve, what you did or did not get closer to, it will be a constant reminder. And I know that leaving out of 2016, I was just barely getting into my stride. And right now I'm already getting into my stride because it's 3.28 a.m. in the morning. It's a Monday. It is the first work day not for the federal government or for some other people, but for me, it is the day that I've been waiting to get back to because I am invigorated. I am excited. I am happy about what uh, what is to come. I'm excited about seeing my goals and my dreams unfold. I'm excited about uh, my physical shape. I'm excited about what is to come. I'm excited, as you should be when you have a clear idea of where it is that you are headed to. Um, when you don't have an idea of where you're headed to, you are completely delusional. Sitting over here in my seat is my 2017 journal, my 2017 planner, and inside of those things are going to be my roadmaps. So I'm I'm never trying to convince anybody that they need to do anything because the fact of the matter is there was an old saying says what you eat don't make me shit. I don't recall who said that may have been Jay Z, but the fact of the matter is is I'm just lend, I, I'm just lending words to whoever wants to listen, but these words that I'm speaking have come from other divine. Uh, areas of life and history that tell me that is the right path and it's the right move to make. So what I'm going to spend a lot of my time doing is not only just growing my business, but developing my family and developing myself um, to make sure that we are not just working on something that is just going to last us for the short time, but that will last uh, my family generations and generations and generations after I'm gone. It is definitely a blessing to come in 2017 to still have a roof over my head, to have power and ambition at my fingertips. It is an absolute blessing. I hope everybody else gets their blessing, gets their helping. I'm going to keep it very simple because uh, the proof is in the pudding. Nobody should talk about it. You got to be about it. So God bless. Take care. Happy Monday, January 2nd, 2017. Talk soon.